What's up everyone, MK Tom Brady here. In this video, there's something that's really, really strange that I wanna look at. So everybody has seen the Rain trailer, just got released today, and a few people noticed something that's really, really strange that you kinda of notice in the trailer if you pay attention that we don't see in the game we have now. I want you to notice Sindel as she is on the ground here. So she gets thrown and knocked down. And look at her animation as she rises. She pops her head up and then rises. I thought this was really strange. So I said, you know, what if I try to duplicate this in MK11 we have now? Like maybe, maybe we're just seeing things, right? Maybe this doesn't exist. So what I wanna do is I wanna to try to duplicate this animation right here. So you see where Sindel is? I have Sindel on the same stage. So Shang Tsung's Island. I wanna knock her face down in the same spot right here that she on this stage that she is in this video. And let's see if we can get this animation. So just so you guys can notice, it obviously it appears as if she did some type of delayed wake up. So if you look at my options here, delayed get up is set to long, get up mode is on. So she will do a delayed get up. So we're gonna start with a face down, knock down, just a generic one. And she's pretty much or close to the same spot. Let's try it a little bit more. Okay, so here we go. Now she's just about in the same spot. If you notice, and we don't see that animation. Notice how she picks her head. Uh, she doesn't really pick her head up at all. She just gets right up. Her head never looks up. I mean, her head never looks up, ever. Now this is a similar type of knockdown on the same map in the exact same spot as the map. And we don't see this animation at all. But Rain did a throw. So maybe Sub-Zero has to do a throw. Sub-Zero coincidentally has the throw that also leaves her on her stomach. And again, in the same spot, we don't see this animation. I've tried this with long, short, no delay at all. The animation is always the same. No matter how I set the knockdown, she always gets up like this. Now, I tried a few knockdowns that knock you face down, Sindel, Sub-Zeros, and a few other characters. Never could I get this. Is this proof of a wake-up system change? Sure, it could be that Rain would have the only knockdown in the entire game where you get knocked down, you know, face down, and this is your uh, wake-up animation. But why would they add new recovery animation? This is not part of the throw. This is part of Sindel's getup. This is not part of her throw. So, I don't really understand why they would add, because much like anything else, like in, in this game that we have now, like in the, in the, in the live version of Mortal Kombat 11, right? Uh, there's no, there's no anything that really shows this. So again, this is the recovery animation. Right? This is her recovery. This is not part of the attack. This is her recovery. Much like if you look at it in the video, this is not part of the attack. So here we go. This is part of her recovery. This is a throw. I think it's clearly a throw. This is not part of the throw. This is Sindel's recovery. Absolutely. I think this is some, some form, some sort of proof that something has been done to the wake-up system. It may not be everything that we want. We don't know. We won't know till the combat casts start coming out and they go over stuff. And maybe not even then, maybe not even till the patch notes. But this, I think, is proof that at least something was changed in the wake-up system. And that's something that we all have to look forward to when this game launches. As always, thanks for watching, everyone. And stay tuned for more content.